show you guys something rather interesting. So um, we're going to do just a, a run-of-the-mill um, relative compression test. I've got a uh, 650 amp clamp on the uh, starter cable and uh, let's do that first. If we look at the yellow trace, which is the relative compression test, you will see that there is a low cylinder in there. This is an eight cylinder engine. Every eighth cylinder is low. I know which one. It's the one that has a pressure transducer in it with a hose that has no check valve. And if we bring channel number two, up to it, you will see that the compression peaks of cylinder number five line up as the weak cylinder shown in the relative compression test. So what can we learn from this test here? We can learn that the test hose without a check valve in it in a running compression test or in a wide open throttle uh, crank compression test will dilute the compression seriously. So you have all the volume of that unchecked hose added to the clearance volume of that cylinder at top dead center and um, you will get a noticeable um, lower compression in that cylinder. It shows up in the relative compression form and the peaks on the um, running compression test or the crank compression test also line up with that cylinder. It's, it's quite considerable.